Okay, so here's the thing. Something kind of scary and a bit odd is going on right now. Um, I didn't want to tell like my friends and my family too soon because I don't want to scare them. But there's actually a hurricane <laughs> coming our way to Aruba, which is insane because um, as far as I know, in 16 years, there hasn't been a hurricane in Aruba. They always pass by or it's a tropical storm, but it never turned into a hurricane. So that's kind of bad. Um, people are actually really calm, ex um, except for the fact that supermarkets are really full and people are like getting water and candles and food and stuff. So yeah, I don't know how to feel about it actually. Um, I'm just trying to stay calm and it's, it's really weird because right now the weather is really good still, like there's sun. I'm even heading to a poetry night at work. So it just seems like nothing is going to happen. Um, but yeah, they expect it to get to Aruba tomorrow during the morning or um, at the end of the day. So I'm really curious, like maybe nothing is happening and maybe like in two days I will be looking at this video and I'll be thinking like, oh, what was I worried about? But for now, I'm kind of worried because like Aruba does not have a good, how do you say that? Like when there's a lot of rain in the Netherlands, they have like this system which makes all the water go away. And in Aruba, because there's like not a lot of rain, they don't have those kind of systems or even like not as good as we have in the Netherlands. So that concerns me a bit. Um, furthermore, the place where I'm staying, like the apartment is really shitty when it comes to water, I think. I think there will be a lot of water there because, I don't know, I just think so. So yeah, we'll have to see how that goes. Um, and I'm also worried because my parents will be um, coming here tomorrow evening and they expect the weather to be um, the worst um, right then. So yeah, I'm a bit worried about that too. But they're making a stop over in Bonaire. So I hope that if something happens, they can stay in Bonaire um, and that they don't have to continue to fly to Aruba. But okay, a lot of preaching, but I'm just a bit worried. So I want to share that with you guys. I really hope and I'm crossing my fingers that nothing is going to happen and that I can laugh about this in a few days. So we shall see. Today is um, Thursday morning and as you can see I went to the supermarket yesterday to get some stuff. I really got like water, um, candles, um, trash, uh, what is it, bags, yeah trash bags and quite some food because um, yeah I think we all started to worry a bit more and uh, during the night it was actually okay but it did start raining quite bad. Um, which is okay, but the thing I'm the most worried about is the fact that there's no wind right now and for the one who know Aruba, there's always a lot of wind, so that concerns me most. I don't know if you've seen the movie, what is it called, The Impossible, then there's this moment when there's like no wind and everybody starts like looking around and then all of a sudden there's just a huge wave okay i know <laughs> that's not going to happen here but still i just don't like the fact that there's no wind because it means that there's like silence before the storm so yeah i'm heading to my internship anyways because i don't want to be stuck at home the entire day so i'm just gonna wait and see how the day and the storm develops and i'm the most worried about my parents because they took off this morning and they um, KLM decided to fly anyways they took uh, an alternative road route um, but still I am concerned because yeah I just hope that they're not underestimating um, the hurricane but since I trust the expertise of KLM I think it will be okay but we shall see what today will bring us and it starts raining while talking as you can see well, I know, is it gonna last? Is it gonna go?
just happened um the hurricane passed and it was bad but it wasn't as bad as it could have been like we had some floodings but um there was no big damage and we didn't need the canned food and we didn't need the candles so that's a good thing but um like a day after the hurricane passed um our electricity shut down which made us use the candles after all but anyways because of the electricity shutdown it had had nothing to do with the hurricane by the way it was just an electricity shutdown um but because of that we had to move and as you can see i'm in another apartment right now and wait let me show you it is smaller than our other one but the nice thing uh, about this apartment is that the air conditioning is really strong which is really nice and then check this out we have an amazing bathroom it's just really big and really nice and then to top it all off we have hot water which is even better since i haven't had a warm hot shower here in aruba for quite some time so that's a good thing and 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 we have pool view i don't know if you can see it from here i think so yes so there we also have the pool view, so that's also nice, but yeah, I'm not sure. I think we have to move back to the other apartment soon because this is a hotel room, so they rent this out to, um, well, non-students, so this will cost them a lot of money. So I'm afraid we have to go back very soon, but I'll enjoy the hot showers as long as I can. These are so big. Crazy. of my parents and we just rented a very cool jeep as you can see and Mike is joining today Hi. and we are road tripping and we want to visit the natural pool and the natural bridge here so that will be a fun day and I'm taking you guys along my mind's telling me no but my body my body is telling me yes Baby, I don't want to hurt nobody But there is something that I must confess Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! You know that I don't play It's not safe, but I never run away Even when I'm away I'm gonna fuck with you Yesterday my parents left, um, which I'm quite sad about, but um, it's okay because in two weeks my friends are coming, so I can't wait for that too. Um, but yeah, we had a very great time and even though they ha didn't have like a lot of sun, they still liked it. And of course, it was more that they wanted to see me instead of the weather, in instead of having nice weather. Um, so yeah, they enjoyed it a lot and they are back in the Netherlands now. So um, with this, I'm going to end this vlog as well. Um, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and um, I see you guys next time.